Hi, this is Dr. Scott Hoare, and today is Treatment Tuesday. We've got a special treatment that we're going to do here today. We're actually going to be doing a PRP injection with our new nurse practitioner, Misty Ford. Misty, Hello. welcome. Thank you. So I've been having a shoulder issue. I Last year, I uh, was in a tubing accident with actually my wife, where we hit shoulders, and there was lots of damage to my AC joint. And ever since then, it's kind of been clicking and clacking and making lots of shifting noises when I'm adjusting or when I'm working out. And today, we're going to try to stabilize that joint and get it to heal a little bit. So, Misty, why don't you tell us a little bit about what prolotherapy is? Yeah, so prolotherapy is sort of your umbrella term. Um, we've got, you can use a proliferant of dextrose or you can use platelet-rich plasma where we draw from your own body and we spin your blood down and get the platelets out and then inject them right into the area where it needs to heal and that will start the healing cascade and then hopefully get him out of pain and get him more shoulder movement. Misty, what are some of the different options for prolotherapy? So we have, prolotherapy is different from cortisone because mm -hmm. cortisone is going to just take the inflammation out of the joint or the tendon that you're working on. But prolotherapy actually heals the body. So it's sort of like your own body healing itself. When you sprain your ankle, you get a pain sensation that goes to your ankle. You get swelling and your body sends white blood cells, um, leukotrienes, all kinds of things down there to heal the tissues. So what we're doing is trying to get the growth factors to heal the tissue and make the body have a healing cascade response. So after we spin it down for about 15 to 30 minutes, we are going to draw out the Buffy coat and the platelet pore plasma. And then we're going to find the areas that he is tender and where he's having some crepitus and we're gonna inject in, into those areas. And that's gonna stimulate my healing yes. and hopefully stabilize that joint that's yes. just moving around mm -hmm. a little too much. Yeah, because a lot of the pain comes from the instability of the joint because that can build up more arthritis, it can get the tendons or ligaments stuck in different places. So we're just trying to make the body heal itself and that's gonna in turn help his pain. But what I'm gonna focus on, not just the AC, we're gonna do the ligaments around it okay. because you have multiple ligaments all in this area and if we just strengthen up one, the other ones may be lax also. So we'll just treat all of it together. Okay, great. It's needle time. It is. Liquid gold. All right, you ready? Yeah. One, two, three, stick. So here we're doing the AC joint and then we are going to do the ligaments right around the bicep. And that's it. All done? All done. How was it? It didn't even hurt. And you didn't even spray the... Uh, I didn't. The numbing spray. All right. Perfect. And now I want you to take your arm through full range of motion and just get all of that fluid moving. All right. Put a couple Band-Aids on you. You get Garfield today since you were such a good boy. Thank you. All right, how'd it go? It was great. Um, I've actually had something like this before and this one didn't hurt hardly at all. Why, do you, why was that? Okay, so I mixed the PRP with lidocaine, so it won't hurt as much when it goes into the tissue because of the anesthetic properties of it. Sure. But the usually we could use ethyl chloride if you're scared of needles. Um, that will just numb the outside skin. It does burn a little bit, but it takes your mind off the needle stick. Mm -hmm. um, but if you, you know, just like you tolerated it really well without having to use it. So the healing cascade is going to start pretty immediately. Mm -hmm. So we have injected it into the ligaments and the tissue surrounding, so your body is going to be tricked to think this is a new injury. So this is actually an old chronic injury. So we're making the blood flow go there, putting all those properties in there to heal that, the growth factors to get your own stem cells to come to heal that tissue. Mm -hmm. And so within the next, you're probably gonna be sore for three to four days just because the healing response is starting. Just like when I talked about earlier, if you sprained your ankle, you're gonna be sore for the next couple days. Obviously we did the shoulder today, Mm -hmm. What are some other body parts or maybe injuries that respond well to um, The PRP? shoulders work well, knees work good. Um, we even do some around the rectorspinae muscles. So we do not go into the spine like mm -hmm. a spine surgeon would do. We just do 
the muscles on the side that will help the stem cells home to that area to try to heal those tissues. Okay. Um, we do, it works really great for neck muscles or people that have, especially if you're at a desk, the muscles in the scapula thoracic bursa will get really knotted and sometimes people have chronic knots back there and that will help break down that adhesion mm -hmm. and help heal it. Got it. Uh, what about like TMJ? TMJ it works really really well for also just because we're having bone deterioration in there every time that pops and clicks and goes out of joint so when their bones rub together that's going to build more arthritis and that's going to cause pain so that will help heal that tissue as well. Got it. Uh, okay, Misty, so people that are wanting a treatment like this, where can they find you and where can they find it? Yeah, so we're at Alcoa Chiropractic Center. Um, we are at 247 East Watt Street, Alcoa. Go. And so just come see us, make an appointment. I would love to, you know, do your exam and see what we can do from there. Thank you so much for watching. This is Dr. Scott Hoare with Misty Ford. Uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and leave a comment below and we'll see you for the next treatment.